Hey guys, what's up? It's Madison. We're backstage in Madison Square Garden. We're with Chris Fenn of Slipknot. What's up, Chris? What's happening? You have some interesting uh, nicknames. Should I call you Chris? Or what's what's the other one? You have two interesting nicknames. Mr. Pickle Nose? Yeah, I don't, I don't <laughs> Those came up way back in the day. They needed to Where did they come from? say something. It was some uh, journalist, I think. And he actually... He just printed it and then it kind of stuck, so... How did the uh, the masks come to uh, fruition? Like, was it part of a publicity stunt? Was it part of the inception of the band? Where did that come yeah, from? Yeah, it was since the beginning. Yeah. You know, it used to be a little bit different, but um, I'm not sure exactly who did the first one. You know, I'm going to punch him right in the face and so find <laughs> out. But, um, no, it's cool. It's, it's always been this way. Well, I mean, do you like it because of the anonymity? Or do you would you prefer to get, like, recognized in public? Do you get recognized in public at all? No, not so <laughs> much. But, but um, some of the other guys do a little bit. Yeah. But it is. It's it's a blessing, you know, just to be able to walk around and, you know, not have to deal with the fame part of it, you know. What about the mask? Do you guys have any kind of say in, in the ones you have? Do you, does it, How often does it change? Or is it constant? Um, mine stays pretty much the same. I mean, obviously, they, they get remade every tour because they just fall apart, you know. But um, some of the guys change drastically, and you know, some of us don't. You know, what's the coolest thing about, uh, I guess, touring and being the best? I mean, there's a preference, and then you hate interviews. But uh, <laughs> what's the best part of the job, and the worst part? The live show. Yeah, it's definitely the best part. I mean, all day long, you know, it's really boring. You know, like we were talking about earlier, it's like, you know, just hurry up and wait all the time. But um, the live shows definitely keeps you going. And I think the worst part is probably traveling so much. Yeah, you know? It sucks. It's, it's rough, yeah. <laughs> you guys have been nominated for several Grammys. Actually, you won once before. Did that mean anything? Or like, it's like, uh, you oh. It's great, that. man. Yeah. You know, that's like the Super Bowl of your industry. Nice. Kinda, you so know there's an I mean? appreciation so, factor. Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. Do you guys sell a ton of albums? And you don't get much uh, radio play. What do you account for the uh, success of the band? Um, I think our fans. Yeah. You know, they just... They're constantly supporting us, even like, you know, when the economy's bad and, you know, r CD sales are down a ton. Um, they still, you know, they still want it. They want the artwork, you know, and they want the physical CD. Like, it's still, we still have that kind of fan base to where, you know, they support. What's your uh, favorite song on the album? Well, it's been doing really well, but uh, um, it's, been it's tough right now, especially with new records, because then. I'll get into something, then I'll be like, like we won't play all the songs live, obviously, and then I'll hear another track off that somewhere else. I'll be like, oh yeah, that song's badass, you know. But um, Gematria is probably my favorite right now. Nice. I heard you're a big gamer. Do you play a lot of video games uh, on the tour bus? Definitely. Or? Yeah, keeps what's, me sane. <laughs> what's your favorite system? Uh, 360. And what do you play? Um, I like to play online. Like I play Frontlines quite yeah. a bit. And um, uh, what did I just get? Oh, Call of Duty. Nice. Yeah, starting to trip out on that online and stuff. Are you, are you good at all or no? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Do the members of the band play or? Yeah, we all we all pretty much game. Nice. Hey, what's up? This is Chris from Slipknot, and you're watching UGO.com. Watch it. Yeah.